Okay, I've got uh, contact. A spacewalk to fix the outside of the International Space Station isn't in the cards, but this group won't exactly be space tourists either. A real estate investor, a former Israeli fighter pilot, and Canadian businessman Mark Pathy paid almost $70 million apiece for the view and a job as mission specialists. Over their eight-day stay, they'll be conducting 26 experiments. The commercialization of space now comes with a twist. This is a very historic moment, uh, and I think is the beginning of many beginnings for uh, commercializing low Earth orbit. A beginning or a symbolic handover of the low Earth orbit economy to the private sector. Last year, Virgin Galactic and Blue Origin sent space tourists to the edge of space, but they only offer a taste of it compared to the full meal guests on the ISS with Axiom get. It's a pretty good thing that more commercial and private companies are becoming interested and are seeing the value in space exploration and in the ways that they can sort of um, expand research here on Earth. 24 years after the launch of the ISS, NASA is focused on getting humans on the moon in 2025 as the first step towards a visit to Mars. And when the ISS is decommissioned sometime around 2030, Axiom is expected to have the first of several commercial space stations floating above the Earth likely filled with millionaires dabbling in science. Microlight Global News, Toronto.